Today, I will show you how to use the latest river pod and freezed packages to build a simple calculator app. I created a Flutter app and named it Flutter Simple Calculator. I updated the Bob spec file to add the app dependencies. I will use the math expressions package for the operations, Riverboard for the state management, and Freeze to generate the models. I started by creating the folders to structure the app. I created a controller folder for the provider. Next, I created the models folder. And finally, I created the UI folder. Inside the UI folder, I created a folder for the pages and a folder for the widgets. Inside the models folder, I created a new Dart file for the calculator model. The model will use three properties to create a calculator, equation, result, and a boolean flag to append the results value. I run the code generator by executing the command in the terminal. Next, I created a Dart file to use it for a utilities class. In this file, I have a function to check if the calculator button is operator or a number and also a function to check if the equation include an operator at the end. I created a Dart file for the colors constants. I created a Dart file inside the controller folder. I will use this file to create the provider for the calculator. In this app, I will use a state notifier. I created the methods for the calculator, like the delete method, the reset method, and the calculate methods. I used the math expression package for the calculation. I created a state notifier provider to return the calculator. Next, we need to create the UI. We will start by creating the widgets. The first widget is the calculator result. Here, I used a column inside a container to display the equation and the result of the calculation. The next widget is to display the calculator rows. I used the elevated button widget to create the calculator buttons. The text on the button will determine the background of the elevated button. The text will also determine the math operation and what function to use from the controller. Next. I created the color buttons widget. I will use it to build the keypad of the calculator. I used a column in a container to build the rows of the calculator. I created a Dart file inside the pages folder. This will be the main page of the app. In this stateless widget, I am using a column 
of two items calculator result and calculator buttons next i created the simple calculator dart file here i have the material app with the calculator page set as its home finally i updated the main.dart file to use the provider scope and set its child to the symbol calculator.